This is one of the most uninhabitable places on Earth, a desert almost devoid of human life. Yet a stunning feat of engineering is being constructed here, a wonder in its own right. In the heart of Chile's Atacama Desert, on a mountaintop 10,000 feet above sea level, the world's largest telescope is being built. This telescope, taller than the Leaning Tower of Pisa, will be capable of observing distant planets in the universe 5,200 times closer than the human eye and will produce images 15 times sharper than the Hubble Space Telescope. Constructing the world's largest telescope in one of the driest places on Earth is nothing short of a miracle. The Atacama Desert, second only to Antarctica, is among the driest areas in the world, with some regions having never seen a drop of rain in recorded history. This telescope will allow us to look back in time to see the universe's first galaxies, stars, and planets. It will also aid scientists in the search for Earth-like planets. Most importantly, it has been an extraordinary challenge for the scientists and construction teams to build a dome the size of a football field on the heights of the Atacama Desert. Stretching 1,000 kilometers along South America's Pacific Ocean front is Chile's Atacama Desert. It is regarded as one of the driest places on Earth after Antarctica, featuring unique landscapes rarely seen elsewhere. Here you'll find frequent volcanoes, vast salt flats spanning thousands of square kilometers, and an endless fog phenomenon unique in the world. But the most essential element for life, water, is entirely absent. Some areas of the Atacama have never experienced rain in their history. This landscape resembles that of an alien planet, which is why the European Space Agency has tested its Mars rovers here. Located 1,300 kilometers from Chile's capital, Santiago, and 130 kilometers from the nearest city, this extraordinary project is being built 10,000 feet above sea level. Known as the European Southern Observatory, or ESO, it is constructing a massive telescope here called the Extremely Large Telescope, ELT. Although still under construction, it's easy to see why it is called extremely large. The telescope will feature an enormous mirror with a 39-meter diameter, four times larger than any existing telescope. This mirror can collect 100 million times more light than the human eye, but only if it remains dust-free. To ensure this, the telescope will be enclosed in a massive steel dome weighing nearly 6,000 tons, equivalent to 2,400 pickup trucks. The dome will have two large doors remaining closed during the day and is tall enough to fit the Statue of Liberty inside. Building the ELT in such a remote location was a monumental challenge. ESO considered several sites in Europe but ultimately chose this South American location. The reasons? They needed a site far from cities to avoid light pollution, which can interfere with telescope images. While many locations in Europe met these criteria, the Atacama Desert was chosen because of its clear skies, 320 cloud-free nights annually. In 2010, ESO's team tested various locations and deemed this 3,000-meter-high mountain, Cerro Armazonis, the best site. However, the sharp, rugged terrain of the mountain posed a major challenge. To construct the telescope, they had to level the mountaintop, creating an area equivalent to seven football fields. This required explosives, which were used to blast 100 meters off the summit, removing 4.7 million cubic meters of Earth, enough to fill 1,911 Olympic-sized swimming pools. After leveling the top, engineers faced a new challenge. Sinkholes began forming due to damage to the mountain's core caused by the explosions. The team used vibrations to artificially stabilize the ground, finally resolving the issue after five years. The foundation was then laid to withstand earthquakes, with hydraulic shock absorbers isolating the telescope and its dome from seismic shocks. By 2023, the foundation was completed, and work on the steel dome began. The dome's structure was pre-assembled at the base camp and transported piece by piece to the summit using remote-controlled trucks. Cranes then joined the steel frames together like a massive Lego set. The telescope's defining feature is its 39-meter mirror, composed of 800 small segments. These segments collect light from space and direct it through a series of mirrors, M2, M3, M4, and M5, 
to create incredibly sharp images. Advanced adaptive optics and powerful lasers correct atmospheric distortions, ensuring clarity in the telescope's observations. The ELT will be the first optical telescope capable of capturing direct images of exoplanets outside our solar system, potentially revealing their atmospheres and the possibility of water, oxygen, or even life. Its enormous mirror will also allow us to look back to the early days of the universe. For context, the Hubble Space Telescope can observe light emitted 13.4 billion years ago, while the ELT will extend this capability by an additional 100 million years, capturing events just 300 million years after the Big Bang. The ELT's construction cost is estimated at $1.6 billion, equivalent to the cost of building the Burj Khalifa. Once completed in 2029, it may help answer one of humanity's greatest questions. Are we alone in the universe? We hope you enjoyed this LearnSphere video. Don't forget to like, share, and comment with your thoughts. Stay tuned for another exciting video.